Hey guys, Rob Bolton here, IMX Productions, 10 Minute Design, and this is the first of many um, website design tutorials. Okay, so today we're gonna look at creating a parallax section on your website. Now if you've seen these um, types of sections before, if you've seen these sections, okay, it's it's really cool, it's really modern, you'll see, you'll see this a lot where it's a section of your website that as you scroll down, the picture behind scrolls at a different speed, it looks almost three-dimensional and it adds a lot of, of character and it just looks really cool on a website. Now I was looking for a long time trying to find a way to do this, okay? It took me a while to find this and I finally found a simple plugin um, to do this. Now it's not a free plugin, it's a paid plugin, but really it's completely worth it. So you're gonna come here to codecanyon.net, okay, codecanyon.net, and you write intense. And you're gonna find this plugin here, Intense Short Code Builder for WordPress. Now, it's $24, okay, and I was willing to pay that for just the parallax functionality, because to me, that was worth it. But that's not all you get with this plugin. There are literally hundreds of short codes for creating anything from pricing tables to columns to bullet lists to sliders to image whatever's okay lots of ways to make a really kind of responsive modern um, interactive website so it's worth 10 times the price of $24 okay and I'm not gonna go through how to install it but you guys know you go in your plugins go to add new um, put in that zip file activate it blah 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 you're in you're good now I've got this test page on my web on my website right here okay I just got some lower mips some uh, text in there and right here I want to add a parallax section Okay, so let's go do that. Ah, just needed a sip of coffee. Oh, so you're in your page editor in WordPress. Okay, now when you installed um, the intense short codes, you get this nice new button right over here, and this is where you're gonna get all your short, short codes. So this is the section where I want my parallax in. So click on short codes, and look, these are all the things you can create with this. Literally, it's amazing. But for now, we want parallax scene. We're gonna click on parallax scene. Okay, and first thing we wanna do is click image, because our background type will be an image. We're gonna go select our image. I decided to get this nice kind of space background I got from, uh, from Google. Okay, now background mode, we're gonna go to parallax, because we want it to scroll that parallax style scroll height. 300 is usually a pretty good height. You don't want it too big or else the parallax won't really have much of, of an effect. Now this is very important here, uh, breakout. Now, pr your site probably has a container, meaning that this, the width of it, so you can see on my, on my page right here, this is my width, I think it's 900 pixels. If I just put the parallax as is, it will stop at that, at that container because it's being contained by a div tag. Um, but I want it to go bang all the way to the edge, regardless of how wide your um, your browser happens to be. I want it to go all the way to the edge. So that's what this neat feature is for. So if you want it to go all the way to the edge, you hit this breakout, and this will break out from the container and force the full width. Perfect. Click Insert Short Code. It throws that short code into your um, editor, and you can see there's two short codes. This is your start and finish. So everything in between here will appear in the parallax. So I'm just going to click a few pages, a few um, lines down, and I'm going to write parallax scene. Woot, woot. Because, you know, I want to show people that we're really excited about this. And I'm going to make that a heading one, and I'm going to make it white colored because my background is quite colorful. Okay, hit update. And let's go back to our page and let's refresh the page. Holy crap, that looks awesome. Look at that. Okay, so we added a really, really cool parallax scene. It's 300 pixels high. You could have made that as high as you want. Anything you add with between those two short codes appears in this box and it just looks so freaking cool. So as you can see, it scrolls and you can set the scroll um, the scroll speed. There's a lot of uh, so many um, options there that I didn't really go into. This is basically all you need to know to properly create a parallax scene. So look how much just look how cool this makes my website. Just just adding this one little parallax scene. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed that. Um, trust me, twenty four dollars is nothing for this this uh, plugin. I'm so happy that I found it and I was 
to be able to do this parallax thing that I've been trying to do for so long. So I hope you enjoyed that quick tutorial. Please um, comment below, let me know if you enjoyed the tutorial. If, if you'd like to see other web design or graphic design or video production tutorials, let me know what you want to see. You can click here to see some other cool videos, okay? And yeah, we'll uh, see you next time. Cheers, this is Rob Baldwin.